On Wednesday, a 51-year-old woman with a broken vertebrae became one of the first people to use Vancouver General Hospital's new biplane neuroangiography unit. The woman slipped at her home about four weeks ago and has been in constant pain despite medication. Dr. Manraj Hurin, a neuroradiologist at the hospital, says the new machines allow doctors a cleaner look at blood vessels in patients' brain, neck, and spinal cord. Is we're going to do a CAT scan with the angio machine, which is something that is quite new as a technology. It avoids us having to take her from this place to a, a specific CT scanner, which is, would be a second step and another move for the patient. So for her, we're going to do it as a quote-unquote one-stop shop. The woman had a cement-like substance injected into her spine to help alleviate the pain. Doctors used the new machine to take a closer look to ensure that the cement hadn't leaked out from the broken vertebrae. Because this fluoroscopy unit allows us very good detail, but the CT scan gives us the ultimate detail. So we're able to actually watch you know, at the same time on both views and not have to toggle back and forth you know, with a camera that has to rotate to do that. Hearn says the machine allows for faster procedure and a faster recovery time. Procedure. Uh, time is how uh, things are actually measured with respect to creating problems, so complications occur directly related to time. So the faster you can do something, the more efficiently you can do it, the less the risk to the patients.